Hello, so this video will be a little bit different from the videos I've done before. Uh, I've done a strange Google Find video and a lot of people seem to have liked that video. But I wanted to get to this one um, only because I'm not getting answers. I've reached out to the Historical Society twice and still no answer. Right across from me. Not going to be able to see anything only because it is surrounded by residential private properties but I am near it and I'm going to post an aerial photo of this strange finding. What I had found was 24 very large circles. These circles range anywhere from 270 feet to 320 feet wide. Now that's actually really, really large. Um, again, I've reached out to Historical Society twice and haven't received a response. The only thing, the only answer I was able to find was that these were a storage area for World War II oil storage tanks. And again, they were very large. There was 24 of them. I am in Bucks County. Um, at one point, lightning had struck one of the tanks, caused a fire. And as of 2006, it is reported that the water near that area is still contaminated. Now what I'm going to do, probably the only thing I can do, is drive on one of the narrow roads residential road or I should say it's a public road it's very narrow I'll have Bob recording two of these circles are near the road I don't know if I'm gonna be able to see anything there is a lot of growth right now um, but these I don't expect to see a lot because these are just large dirt circle mounds so, one of the things that does concern me is um, since 2006 the groundwater was still contaminated is actually was that information disclosed to the people that own those homes now? That I don't know. Um, that statement with the uh, disclosure um, is meant to be thought provoking, not panic creating. Um, just so you know, after that video was made, I put even additional hours into research into trying to find the answer to this, and I still haven't found anything. I've even uh, found new contact information, and I reached out to them to no response, and that was four days ago. Um, so I really am curious, uh, since I only found one piece of information, that doesn't necessarily make it credible. Uh, just keep that in mind. Um, but I do believe that there were uh, oil storage tanks there. Uh, the additional hours of research included trying to find a, an article um, about the oil tank fire. Um, one of the oil tanks being struck by lightning. And I still haven't found anything. I have uh, newspapers.com access. Uh, there's, I know, there. you have to actually use the right keywords and everything like that. Um, and they don't have uh, a lot of newspapers uh, published there. But I, I tried every trick in a book that I know to try to find the answer uh, as to... Um, confirming that one piece of information I found uh, is viable piece of information, is credible piece of information, and uh, just general, like, I, I reached out to a, a, a local newspaper um, connection that I have, and he's familiar with that area, and he even said it's a heavily wooded area, and he's never, he's never seen this before. Um, it's just, uh, 
it, it's times like this which makes it frustrating because what I wanted to do was to provide a mystery to answer video. Um, not like the, the first letters video I had. I, I didn't have the answer to that one. I did that one. Um, but in the future, what I want to try to do when I come across something like this is to provide a mystery to answer video. Uh, this way you're not waiting for a follow-up. But th this one, I, I put a lot of hours into trying to find uh, the answer to this. And I'm just, it's, I keep running into dead ends. Um, so if, if you know anybody in the area, um, this is in Lower Bucks County. It's in Solberry Township. Uh, if you know anybody or even know, you know, what it was, if the information I found is credible, uh, let me know in the comments below. Um, if you have an answer, I'll pin your comment and uh, I'll squash this mystery. And uh, yeah, it's, it's frustrating. But, but thank you all so much for coming along with me on this video and see y'all later. Bye.